What's going on guys, it's Marky Williams. Welcome back to my channel, online certification course. Here you're gonna take this journey with me as we talk about management development programs. But first, the intro. What's going on guys? Management, management, management. Management been getting a rough deal these days for the past few years actually. Where should I start? I'm in a few groups on social media that has to do with you know online certification courses, educational um, groups. And a lot of their videos come about with management and how they you know they're toxic and other crazy stuff that goes with it so and someone actually mentioned which stuck with me was they didn't want to quit their job they were just trying to quit management and that's crazy that you could be at a place that you love great pay benefits co-workers but it comes to that one person management that one manager in your department can blow all that out the door. You're out behind one person. So that's why management development need to be implemented into these companies, small and large. And that's what we're gonna go over right quick. So when it comes to management development, just keep it simple. It's gonna be getting trained on soft skills, conflict resolution, interpersonal skills, uh, leadership, proper team building, delegation and motivation. All of those are in that program. Let me ask you something. When was the last time you had your manager help you succeed in your position? Help you get promoted from within? Gave you leadership, guidance? When was the last time? Comment down below. I would like to hear it. When the last time management gave you resources to actually do your job? For people who know me personally, if they're on here, thanks, shout out, comment down below, say hey. But people who personally know me and from the, the last job I was at for 22 years, no manager, no management, never pulled me to the side and say hey, there's a position I think you should take up. You do good. Never in 22 years. Any position that popped up in there and I knew I can get it, I applied for it. No one vouched for me. And I ran with it. The only people that was actually vouching is the people who knew my work ethics in other departments. Not my direct manager saying, hey, get this position. I need you there. No. Management development includes that. It helps you push, helps your coworkers, your team succeed. If they have other aspirations in that company, they should come and confide it within you. Hey, I'd like to get that position. Let management go and vouch for you for that position. When was the last time that actually happened? At your place? Cause I damn sure never saw it at mine. <laughs> So with the management development program, the course, this will keep management accountable for their actions in their department. If it's a high turnaround within that department after management has taken this type of program, this course got certified in it, there shouldn't be hiring and firing, firing and hiring, people leaving, people coming, people irate, productivity's low, Morale is low. With that certification that these managers will have through the development program, there shouldn't be none of this. And it holds them accountable when companies start doing exit reviews. <gasps> That's right. If an employee is quitting, 
or they get fired. They get a sit down. Not with that manager, but his higher up. And you should be spilling the beans. And they keep an account as to why you leave it. And like I said, eight out of 10 times, they point towards the management that they're toxic. Accountability when it comes to this program development course. Let me drop a few more nuggets before I get up on out of here. Management from 15 to 20 plus years ago, the bosses thought the managers were actually good when there's always conflict, confusion, the back and forth with their employees, the coworkers. They thought that was being productive. No, it's not being productive. 2024 management is creating work-life balance, autonomous work, remote work, micromanaging. <laughs> they still do it. It's the thing of the past though. If you got to do all that, you're doing something wrong as manager is you it's not the employees you're doing something wrong you should be able to delegate evenly accordingly fairly you should have it to the point that when your co-workers your team comes in you really don't have to say anything to them they know where to pick up where they left off the day before true story Thank you. So what part do you play in this management position? Are you going to give retention, productivity, growth? Or are you just going to be a sour b The choice is yours. Many thanks for checking me out right now. Like, subscribe comment below as to what you'd like to get certified in i can personally send you a link to check out also there'll be links in the description below online certification courses to help you be a better manager and also check out these thumbnails as well that's going to be floating around up in here many thanks once again it's marky williams and i'm out